Hey, Robbie here, Overland Club of the Philippines and OCP Customs. Today we'll be doing a demo uh, comparing the Camp Aid folding bed that I'm used to using and the Decathlon uh, all-in-one camp bed that's supposed to be quick deploy. So we're gonna time it and see how long it'll take to assemble each of these and we'll compare how it goes. Alright, we'll start with uh, Camp Aid. I have a timer here. We're gonna time it starting now. Stop. Two minutes, one second assemble this all right all right now for the decathlon easy assemble camp bed okay timer starts now One minute, eight seconds. Not bad. Ease of deployment. This is faster to deploy. This is slower to deploy. However, the bag. The bag that comes with this is easier because it just zips open and you have access to the full item. Whereas here, you have to pull out the whole bed from the bag by pulling it out. Extra features. This comes with a pocket for you to put your stuff. This one doesn't. Weight. In my, in my, if I carry it, both of them weigh roughly the same. Not much of a difference in weight between the two, including size. Both bags, when they're packed, they're just about the same size when you pack them. Locking mechanism. The way this folding bed locks is through this. You lift it to unlock, you pull it down and it will lock. This one, on the other hand, comes with a rigid bar that goes from here to here, as you've seen in the assembly. The good thing is that for this one, whenever you want to lift it, it stays rigid. This one, however, when you lift it, it becomes loose because there's no rigid bar. It keeps it straight. So when you need to move the bed around, this stays rigid, this one doesn't. Size and comfort, they're just about the same. Width-wise, it's just about the same. This one is slightly narrower, but just, just slightly, almost negligible. However, if you're a tall person, there's no bar at the end of this that will you know, have a hard surface for you to lay on. Whereas here, this will have a hard surface for you to lay on if you're very tall. Otherwise, they're just about the same in terms of comfort. Material, this is made of uh, square tubing. This is made of tubular tubing. Um, Weight-wise, they're just about the same. Fabric, this is slightly thicker. This is slightly thinner. However, the feel of it is the same. But the thing is, if this gets dirty, the color obviously is lighter compared to this. If this gets dirty, it's black, so it doesn't look dirty when it's actually dirty. For both items, the fabric is not removable from the frame, so therefore, you can't wash it separately. Stability, they'll be just about the same when you're using it at camp. However, if you need to move things around, again, this one remains rigid, this one becomes flimsy, so when you need to move it around camp, then that's the difference. Price-wise, more expensive, less expensive. So, which one would you pick? At the end of the day, they both serve the same purpose. They're both a compact folding bed that you can pack away and take with you when you're camping, when you're elevated above the ground. Price-wise, there's a slight difference, although one is easier to deploy, one is a bit difficult to deploy. However, they both serve the same purpose and they have their own pros and cons. My question is, which one would you pick amongst these two? Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe for more.